Hey, Amy, can I borrow your red marker? Oh, sure. Amy, what's wrong? Take cover, she's about to blow! Achoo! Here you go. Uh, hope you have some hand sanitizer in your bag, Sophia. Aloe vera plants. For this prank, take an aloe vera leaf and slice it in half. Now scoop out the clear goo with your fingers. Ew, it's so slimy. Something tells me Sophia's about to put Amy in a snotty situation. Here goes nothing. Achoo! Hey, Amy, you want your marker back? Ew, look at all that goo. Ew, is this a ton of your snot? Ooh. Cool your jets, Amy, it's just aloe vera. See, no germs here. Even so, it's still pretty gross. Shh, we've gotta be quiet, it's test day. Okay, everyone looks hard at work. I guess I may as well get some of my work done then. Wow, look at these hard-working students go. Oh, looks like the head teacher needs to speak to me. I'd better go. Is she seriously leaving us? When the teacher's away, the students will play. Now's the perfect time to pull an epic prank on Mrs. Appleby. Oh man, she's not even gonna realize her mug of coffee is upside down! Quick, clean up the excess coffee! Now get back to your seats before she comes back. We totally nailed that one. Well, everything looks normal here. Alright, where was I? Ah yes, here we go. Boom! That coffee's going everywhere! I don't remember putting this thing down upside down! Stop <laughs> laughing, girls! You've given yourselves away! I know yelling is not the answer here, but detention sure is! Pack up, ladies, you're going! Detention stinks, but it was totally worth it. Well, that'll ring more true after we're done. Mr. Smith looks like he's had quite a morning. And what better way to teach a class when you're tired than to put on some slides? Shoot, I left the cord in my car. Be back in three minutes, people. All this waiting is not helping the students stay awake, is it? Okay, catch this M&M and I'll give you five bucks. Uh-oh. Did that thing just turn the copy machine on? That was pretty cool, right? Quick, copy my face! Copy my face! Oh my gosh, this is so fun. My face looks insane. Hey, Mr. Smith left his laptop. Let's prank him with a copy machine! Watch out, Teach. These bored girls are about to get very creative. Hi, Mr. Smith! I found the cord. Just gonna hook this up to my computer and we can get started with the projections. Hmm, that's weird. Why isn't anything changing on my screen? Is it my mouse? Come on, what the heck is going on with this thing? That's it. I'm ready to throw this stupid thing out the window! Wait a second. Is this a fake screen? Yep, you just got duped, Mr. Smith. I'll admit it was a pretty clever prank, but you girls are in serious trouble. Nothing's worse than showing up to class and realizing you forgot a pencil. Hey, Lily! Yoo-hoo! Turn around! Do you have a pencil to spare? Pretty please? Thank you so much! Seriously? What am I supposed to do now? Lana! Think I can snag your pencil sharpener? Please? I'll buy you a cookie later? You're a lifesaver. Almost there. Ugh. Shh. You ruined my concentration, so I may as well take a water break. Ah, that's better. Psst. Lily, can I get a sip of that? Hey, I'm really thirsty, okay? Sure, you can have a sip. Right, Lana? Oh yeah, definitely. Okay, hold on just one quick second. Never miss the opportunity for a good water prank. Simply take the blade and make a small cut just above the water bottle label, like this. Pretty simple, right? Still thirsty, Kevin? It's all yours! Oh, poor guy didn't even see this one coming. Barely any of the water is even getting into his mouth. 
Oh man, this stuff is ice cold! This is so embarrassing. Up top, sis. I'm still thirsty, you know. Everyone has one of those friends that talks and talks and talks. Even if it's right in the middle of a geography lesson. And I was like, sure, I'll go to the dance with you. As long as you get a haircut. Shh. I'm trying to listen here. Do you mind? Yep, Sophia definitely minds. Fine. She doesn't want me to talk? I'll bite my tongue. Or rather, pierce it. Try this prank on for size. Hey, Ilana. You wanna get me to stop talking, huh? Well, this ought to do the trick. Oh my goodness! Sophia! Somebody help her! What now? Oh my. Are you doing what I think you're doing? Okay, if you look a little closer, you'll see not everything is as it seems. Give me that thing. Looks like we've got a master prankster on our hands. That's it, you're both going to the principal's office. Pranking's awful fun, but it often comes with a price. Look on the bright side, Lana. At least Sophia finally shut up. Some days it takes everything you have to stay awake in class. What? Whoops, I fell asleep. I better get going. Guys, the bell doesn't dismiss you, I do. Now sit down. Oh man, we were so close to being out of here. What time did I eat breakfast? Like, four hours ago? My stomach is grumbling something fierce. Maybe I have something at the bottom of my backpack? Let's see here. Okay, Miss Appleby isn't looking. I'm gonna dive on this pasta I whipped up last night. Huh? Is this pasta even cooked? Hey, Kate. Look what I have. Wanna do a little pranking this fine afternoon? Okay, I just gotta get to that chair without the teacher seeing me. Yikes, that was close. Now I'm gonna put some of my dry pasta underneath the legs. Don't turn around. Please don't turn around. No! Did I hear someone say something? Nothing to see here, Teach. We're just taking notes. Oh boy, here comes the big moment. What on earth was that crunching noise? Did the chair break or something? <laughs> Jennifer, that was awesome. You're the queen of pranks. <gasps> Why do my eyelids always feel heavier in my classes just after lunch? Um, am I boring you, Miss Sophia? Wake up! <gasps> what? Oh, shoot. Not it off again. Wait a sec. I have an idea. Wish you had a pair of glasses like this to wear through those extra boring lectures. Print out a large picture of you in a pair of glasses like this one. Cut out each of the lenses of the glasses. Next, stick those suckers right onto your actual specs. You can put double-sided tape on the eyes or clear glue. Perfect fit. Whoa, that looks creepy real. So next time you're sitting in another boring class fighting to stay awake, pop on a pair of these bad boys and head off to dreamland. Hey, Sophia, do you… Sophia? Oh, that explains it. I'll let her borrow my notes later. She'll need them for sure. Ah, <sighs> sweet dreams, girl. Sneaking into the teacher's lounge? That's awfully risky. Shh, there's Miss Appleby. A very sleepy Miss Appleby. And lucky for us, a sleeping teacher is the perfect prey. For this prank, you'll need a mug and a toy spider like this one. Just drop that sucker in the cup and pour the coffee right onto it. Miss Appleby likes her coffee with cream and spiders, right? Wake up, Miss Appleby! Oh. We brought you coffee, Miss Appleby. Wow, what nice students I have. And now we wait for the pranking magic to happen. Looks like that coffee's running a little low there, Teach. Ugh, spider! 
Yes, it totally worked!